Hey everybody, Rob here from More Music in Evansville, Indiana, moreguitars.com. Got my buddy Ed with me here today, and we've got a couple of PRS Vela guitars, but they're slightly different, so we're going we're gonna to talk about what the, the similarities are, what the differences are, let you hear the differences so that you can make a better buying decision. So here we go. How are you, Ed? Great, great. We do have virtually two identical guitars here, do. right down to the finish. <laughs> the only difference is that mine is a semi-hollow. And yours is not. Mine is not. Mine is the solid body. So these are the S2, PRS S2 series Vela guitars. Um, just got in the semi-hollow version, which uh, was just, just recently introduced, and you know, we're just getting our first ones in. We thought it would be a good opportunity to bring both guitars in and see how, they, how, they, how similar they sound or how different they sound. And uh, th this would be the first time we've done this, so. Yeah, first be a opportunity. Learning, learning experience for us, too. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to jump right to the neck position pickup, which yeah. is the Type D single coil. Um, when I sell so semi hollow body guitars like this, really the main difference besides the weight relief is that I think it's, you have a little bit more resonance, and it's a little more open sounding on the bass end of the guitar. Yeah, definitely fatter, kind of in the mid to low range, but maybe doesn't quite have the snap and bite that the solid body will. Right. So it just kind of depends on what you need the guitar to do. Yeah, yeah. What kind of music you're playing, that kind of thing. Why don't you play uh, something that something, accentuates something? Yeah, the okay. bass end. That's what I'm talking about when you get those. Yeah. 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 So that's really what, what I hear and what, what I really like about an instrument like this. It does make it unique as compared to a solid body guitar. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, definitely. That's got a little more. <laughs> yeah. <Ugh>. You know, <laughs> I mean, it's not like we need that much of a reason to get a new guitar, but if you don't have a semi hollow body instrument like this in your collection, uh, it's worth it. It definitely is a unique sound. So we should we go to the opposite extreme, like screaming metal or something like that, yes. and see what the difference yes. is? Yes, yes, let's. We're always looking for a yeah. reason to go to screaming yeah. metal sound. Yeah. Me first? You go first. Yeah. <laughs> I want to do this. Are you on the neck pickup? Yeah, all right, I'll go to the bridge. Play the same thing you do. <laughs> it's there. So the question is, can you play metal with a semi-hollow guitar? The answer is, yes. Of course you can. Of course you can. Yeah. Oh. But I mean, you know, I guess there's a lot of factors that go into that. Are you yeah. detuning? Are you are you trying to cut through a really thick mix? Mm -hmm. It sounds good here. We just got guitars going, but you add bass and drums and all that other low end that's going on, and you might get kind of lost. Yeah. And there's that possibility. Sure. But. But you know. You know, what are you going to do? <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, whatever drawbacks I was just thinking, you know, we just, we're guitar players. We know how to turn the guitar off. We know how to turn the guitar off. Yeah, I mean, you compensate. You're like, yeah. oh, you know, you got your amp. There, there's so much that goes into just, it's not just the guitar. There's the amp and the controls and the cabinet and the how how you attack the guitar. And, and you know, I think you and I both know that depending on, you know, gu guitar players know how to get certain sounds out of certain guitars. Oh, yeah. The guitar's giving you one thing you know how to get another thing out of it. That's know? a really that's, good that's, point, yeah. That's that's just comes with time and, and experience and... Desperation. Desperation. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna go to a mid-gain uh, setting, okay. the channel two on this amplifier, back to the type D. <laughs> This is a joy to play. I really am a big fan of the of the Vela. It's it's a, it's a guitar that's unlike any that I personally own. They're both great guitars, yeah. and they're a, they're a, it's a good other guitar to have. You know, it's it's not gonna may not be your only guitar, but it's a good other guitar Absolutely. to have in your collection and something to uh, to 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 give your you know to have a little fun with. So, yeah. which one would you choose? Would you go solid body or would you go semi hollow? We'd love to uh, read your comments, so be be sure to leave us one. And uh, if you have any questions on these two guitars or any PRS guitars or anything that we have in our catalog, you just need to give us a call. Or you can send us an email or you can live chat with us on the website. Mm -hmm. We're easy to get a hold of and we want to hear from you. So please reach out to us. Ed, you got anything else to say? Nothing except thank you very much for your time and uh, hope to see and hear from you soon. Come back and join us, won't you? And bring a friend.